Right now at 530 was a deadly stabbing near Rittenhouse Square. Self-defense opening statements in the closely watched trial begin. And we're learning a lot more about the strategies from the prosecution and the defense. 22-year-old Michael White is charged with fatally stabbing a real estate developer. Supporters of White and the victim both packed a Center City courtroom today. Shantae Lands is live outside of the Criminal Justice Center with more on the opening statements from both sides. Shantae. Well, Jessica and Natasha, the prosecution called five witnesses to the stand today. They're expected to call 14 total during the trial. One of those witnesses was a homicide detective with Philadelphia PD. He narrated over video, cell phone video, showing the moment that Skellinger was stabbed in his back. That moment too much for his mother to bear. The loss is a loss. It's tragic on both, both parties. Justice for Sean Buttons, worn by family and friends to represent a show of solidarity in memory of slain real estate developer, 37-year-old Sean Skellinger. Opening statements began this morning on the third floor of the Criminal Justice Center in the voluntary manslaughter trial for Michael White. The 22-year-old is accused of fatally stabbing Skellinger near Rittenhouse Square in July of 2018. Assistant District Attorney Anthony Voci called White an aggressive killer by inserting himself into a traffic dispute at 17th and Chancellor Streets. But during the defense's opening statement, Skellinger was described as the aggressor. The defense told the jury that Skellinger, quote, threatened to beat the black off of him when referring to White. Witnesses say White was riding his bike as an Uber Eats courier on Chancellor Street. What was most revealing in court, video shown and narrated by a Philadelphia homicide detective on the stand describing the moment Skellinger lifted White off the ground and White stabbed Skellinger once in the back. White is claiming self-defense. Some religious leaders from the Philadelphia area are backing Michael White. To be perfectly honest with you, I have a college son and my son was also a delivery person. And I can't imagine, you know, the trauma that his family, his mother and father are going through right now. And there is a gag order in place. Sean Skellinger's family declined to comment. Michael White, according to the defense attorney, may have to testify during this trial. Reporting live outside of the Criminal Justice Center in Center City, Shantae Lands, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Shantae, thank you.